Our facility has 10 direct-to-substrate printers printing hundreds of tire covers a day, both for dealerships and individuals. I wanted to dedicate this video to helping people determine the correct tire cover size for their tire when ordering. The first step is to determine if your Jeep has a backup camera. If it does, you're going to need a specific tire cover with a hole in the center for the backup camera. If not, you'd use a standard tire cover with no hole. The next step is to go to your Jeep tire on the back of your Jeep and find a set of numbers, usually begins with the P, that looks similar to this. Um, you take this set of numbers and go to tirecoverpro.com, click on the tire cover size calculator. Um, one of the most common sizes out there is the 245. 75 R17 but there are dozens of sizes so you will want to check your tire to get the right size tire cover so we're going to calculate that that one returns back 31.5 inches since tire covers come in nine different sizes ranging from 28 inches all the way up to 37 inches in this case at 31.5 a 32 inch tire cover would be what what you would need. A 31 inch would be just a little bit too tight. They do stretch, but they don't stretch that much. In the case of this one here at 255.75 R17, when we calculate that one, it comes in at 32.1 inches. So for this one, you could round down to 32 inch and it'll stretch a little bit and be nice and tight for you, but they don't stretch that much. So you wanna round up in most cases. Um, hope this helps take the mystery out of your tire cover size, and we look forward to your order. If you have any questions, please contact us. Thank you. Many buyers ask how they can make their classic accessories cover last as long as possible with the best possible care and storage. Here are some tips. There aren't many because it is really easy. Use mild soap and water to clean the cover and be sure to use a rag rather than a brush. The bristles can damage the protective coating that will help your cover last as long as possible. Never put away a damp cover as mildew can damage it. Be sure to dry it while unrolled before storing it if it is at all damp. Be sure to use the provided storage bag when putting the cover away for long periods of time. Folding and rolling the cover the way it came will make it much easier to install when you need to get it out again, as it will be correctly aligned when placed on the roof. You'll find caring for and storing your RV cover from Classic Accessories is extremely convenient and easy. Mm -hmm.